Well, thank you so much, Ren. I too would like to begin uh, my remarks today by acknowledging that we meet on the stolen lands of the Ngunnawal and Ngambri peoples, and I pay my respects to their elders, past, present, and emerging. My name is Jonathan Davis. I'm the ACT Greens candidate for the Tuggeranong seat of Brindabella in October's ACT election. And aptly for today, I'm also the Greens spokesperson for both education and for young people. It is in that uh, vein that I want to firmly uh, solidify our commitment behind your movement, behind this protest and behind the collective efforts of all students to fight against the Morrison McCormack's cruel cuts to students and to the university sector. You have a friend in the Greens, you have a friend in the Greens in local councils, state and territory parliaments and in the federal parliament. It is a commitment of the Australian Greens since its inception that education from preschool right through to postgraduate education should be free, universally accessible and supported by governments. You have that commitment from us. <laughs> All of this started to come out that fees are actually going to go down, a promising sign, right? Until we realise that this whole plan is a reinforced, uh, reinforcement of an ideological commitment by the Liberal Party, by the National Party, to stop critical thought in an informed electorate, to make it even more difficult for young people to be able to adapt to the employment opportunities in the future, but instead to make it easier for some students to get particular qualifications that suit their donors and that suit the business opportunities of their donors. Don't be fooled, friends. This is a strategic policy developed specifically in attempt to pit student against student.